Shyama Shastri IAST Shyama Sastri the 26th of April 1762 to 1827 or Shyama Sastri was a musician and composer of Carnatic music He was the oldest among the trinity of Carnatic music Tyagaraja and Mutuswami Dikshitar being the other two Early life and career Shyama Shastri was born on 26 April 1762 in a Brahmin family in Tiruvarur in what is now the state of Tamil Nadu. He received his instruction in the Vedas, astrology, and other traditional subjects early on and learned music from his maternal uncle. He was later trained in music by Adiapaya, a noted Durbar musician of Thanjavur. Although Sayama Sastri did not compose as so many critics as his two prolific contemporaries, his compositions are still well known due to the literary, melodic, and rhythmic proficiency observed in them. It is said that he composed about 300 pieces in all. He did not have many disciples to propagate his compositions, nor was the printing press widely accessible during his time. More importantly, the scholarly nature of his compositions made them more appealing to the learned than to the lay. His compositions are far fewer in number than Tyagaraja or Dikshita. Additionally, they feature a more formal form of Telugu which borrows heavily from Sanskrit. In contrast, Tyagaraja composes in this form of Telugu but also resorts to a more colloquial dialect to which Shyama Shastri does not. There are also a number of Krithis in Tamil attributed to him. Most of his compositions propitiate the goddess Kamakshi. He composed Kritis, Varnas and Svarajatis with the Ankita or Mudra signature Sayama Krishna. He was probably the first to compose in a new form of the Svarajati musical genre, where the compositions could be rendered solely in a singing or instrumental manner. Prior to this, the Svarajati was primarily a dance form, and was close in structure to the dance Varnam His set of three famous Svarajatis are intended to be sung in concert rather than danced, and are sometimes referred to as Ratnatrayam, three jewels. They are Kamakshi Anudanamu, Kamakshi Padugame, and Rave Himajiri Kumari, composed in the Ragas Bhairavi, Yadakula Kamboji and Todi respectively. The former two are set to Misra Kapu Tala, while the third is set to Adi Tala. He was known for his ability to compose in the most complex of Talas. He was also widely revered for his voice and singing ability during his time. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Death and Legacy. Shyama Shastri died in Thanjavur in 1827. He had two sons, Panju Shastri and Subaraya Shastri. Panju was a devoted worshipper of the deity, Bangaru Kamakshi. Subaraya was trained in music by his father and became a gifted composer as well as a noted player of the Veena. At his father's behest, he was also trained by Tyagaraja, Shyama Shastri's renowned contemporary. Shyama Shastri's adopted grandson, Anasvami Shastri (1827–1900), was also a fine composer. Shastri had a number of disciples who excelled at the art. Alajur Krishna Iyer became a musician at the Royal Durbar in Mysore. Porambar Krishna Iyer popularized many of his guru's works. 
Another disciple, Talagambadi Panchanada Iyer also made his mark as a composer. Another disciple named Dasari gained fame as a noted Nagaswaram player. Compositions The below sections mention some of his compositions. Svara Jati Kriti See also List of Carnatic composers <laughs> Notes <laughs>